girls can play cricket. Akshay waited for his friends to arrive at the playground. When they came, three boys and two girls were all excited to see the cricket set Akshay had got for his birthday. Let's make two teams and play a match, said Akshay. I'll be the captain of one team. Rajat, you can be the captain of other. You can select your team and I'll select mine. They started calling out the names. Ajay, Vicky, the girls waited for the names to be called out. When neither of the captains called out their names, Simran asked, What about us? Well, girls can't play cricket, said Akshay. You can watch us play, he added kindly. Yes, you can cheer your favorite team, said Rajat. The girls got so angry that they turned and walked back home. It's not fair. We're friends. We should be playing together, cried Simran. We should teach them a lesson, said Preeti. Simran's mother heard the girls talking. What's the matter, girls? You look upset, she said. The girls explained what had happened to them. I know what you can do, said Simran's mother. Make your own cricket team and challenge the boys to a match. But we don't have a cricket set, said Simran. And we don't know how to play cricket, said Preeti. Don't worry about that, said Simran's mother. I can teach you. I was the captain of the girls' cricket team at school. How would you like a cricket set for your birthday next week, Simran? Oh, mummy, you're great, cried Simran as she kissed her. For the next two weeks, Simran and Preeti practiced batting, bowling, and fielding. Simran's mother taught them all the techniques and rules. Preeti's mother also joined them. Soon, they became quite good at the game. Simran was specially good at bowling. Let's go to the playground and show the boys, said Simran. The girls and their others went to the playground and set up the stumps and bales. Soon the boys arrived. They laughed when they saw the girls playing cricket. How about a match, asked Simran. Don't be silly. Girls can't play cricket, said Akshay. Why don't you play with us and find out, said Simran's mother. Will you play, auntie, asked Ajay, if you don't mind, said Simran's mother. Otherwise, two girls against four boys wouldn't be fair. The boys were a little surprised. All right, auntie, but please be careful. We don't want you to get hurt, said Akshay. The match started. The boys won the toss and Akshay was the first to bat. He hit the very first ball for four runs. Come on, Simran, shouted Preeti. Ball your fast ones. Akshay hit two more runs, but he was out of the next ball. Clean ball. He couldn't believe it. It was Rajat's turn next. The balls were so fast that the first two just whistled past him. He realized that he would have to try his best. It would not be an easy victory. He hit the next ball high for six runs. The boys jumped with joy. Rajat made 15 runs and then he was run out. Ajay and Vijay made another four runs each and then they two were out. They had scored 29 runs in all. Don't worry, we'll get the girls out in no time, said Rajat. Simran faced Rajat nervously as he balled the first ball. It missed the stumps by an inch, just saved. I mustn't be nervous, thought Simran as she faced Rajat again. This time she hit the ball for one run. Slowly the runs began to pile up. Two runs, three runs, another one and then she hit a four. Soon she had made 15 runs. The boys were getting worried when all of a sudden Simran was clean balled. It's your turn, Preeti, she called out. Don't let them win. Preeti hit six more runs before she was out. Now it was her mother's turn. She was clean balled on the first ball. You'll have to make five runs somehow, mummy, said Simran. As the mother went into bat, she scored two runs. There were no runs in the next over. Hurry up, mummy, called out Simran. The ball flew in the air for four runs. They had done it. They had won the game. The girls jumped with joy. The boys clapped for them. We'll play together from now on, said Akshay. And now we all know, girls can play cricket. Everyone joined in.